Hello guys, this is Amos Stall Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play more from League of Legends by KDA. So here we go, pretty catchy chorus section, give you a preview of the section before we start learning it, it goes like this, check it out. Yeah. Again, afterwards, you can repeat it with improvisations. You can be like. Okay, that kind of thing. Afterwards. So let's get the melody and block chords first. And then afterwards, you can like add your own improvisations. So we'll break this lesson up into four parts. It's easier to learn. First part starts like this. Right hand starts with the G sharp here. Middle C, go up an octave C up to the G sharp. So it goes G sharp. G sharp B and then three A's one two three and then A G sharp F sharp E F sharp and then it goes four G sharps one two three four F sharp G sharp F sharp okay that's it for the first part one more time it goes G sharp G sharp B A A A A G sharp F sharp E F sharp four G sharps one two three four F sharp G sharp F sharp all right and that's it for the right hand left hand we have four chords here four chords that are pre pretty important because the first two parts contain these four chords in this particular pattern so the four chords are c sharp major which is c sharp f g sharp second chord is a major which is a c sharp e third chord is f sharp minor which is f sharp a c sharp and fourth chord is b major which is b d sharp f sharp so with these four chords in mind so c sharp major a major f sharp minor and b major the two ends together goes like this g sharp and c sharp major together a and A major together, F sharp and F sharp minor together, B major by itself. That's it for the first part. All right, let's do it again. So it goes together, 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 here. Okay, moving on to the second part. Right continues. Goes G sharp, G sharp B, and then three A's. One, two, three. A G sharp, F sharp E, F sharp, and then two G sharps. That's it for the second part for the right hand. Let's do it again. Let's go G sharp, G sharp B, A, 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 G sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp, and then two G sharps. All right. As I said before, the left hand, same four chords as the first part. So the four chords are C sharp major, which is C sharp, F, G sharp, A major, F sharp minor, and B major. So the exact same four chords as the first part that you know just then. Two hands together goes like this. G sharp and C sharp major together. A and A major together. F sharp and F sharp minor together. B major by itself. Running continues. That's it for the second part. One more time. Let's go together. 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 Here. And that's it for the second part. So back to back, the two parts of learned so far will be played like this. Now, moving on to the third part, Ryan goes, two C sharps, two F, two F sharps, A, 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 B, A, G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, F sharp, F. That's it for the right hand, all right? Let's do it again. It goes, C sharp, C sharp, F, F, F sharp, F sharp, A, 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 B, A, G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, G sharp, F sharp, F. That's it for the right hand. Left hand this time, the four chords are similar to the other four chords, but one chord is replaced. So the first chord, same, C sharp major. The second chord is different this time. It's second, uh, first inversion of F sharp minor, which is A, C sharp, F sharp. And the third chord, same, F sharp minor and B major for the fourth chord. Okay, so it's pretty much the same four chords that you learned, but just replaced the uh, second chord before it was A major, but now replace it to first version F sharp minor. You can see there's only one note difference. The top note moves up to the F sharp for this one okay two hands together goes like this so c sharp and c sharp major together f sharp and chord together a and f sharp minor together g sharp and b major together that's it for this part one more time let's go together 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 yeah and then the fourth part is actually exactly the same as this third part so you just repeat it And 
And that's it. That's all the four parts of this lesson. So back to back, all four parts of this lesson will be played like this. Check it out. There you go. So, now, once you get the melody and chords of this all good, you can start to add your own improvisations to make it more interesting and then like bigger, like in the original song is very like thick in texture. So left hand you can do like octave bass notes, arpeggios, rhythmic patterns. That kind of thing. And right hand you can harmonize the bass on the chords to make it thicker in texture. So you can do something like this, you can be like. There you go. Okay, so pretty catchy stuff. So you can make it big like that, or else you can just like make whatever version you want based on what improvisations you know. Okay, so if you want to do like a calm lull lullaby version, you can be like. Yeah, you can do something like that if you want as well, okay? It's really up to you. The limits is like endless, okay? But anyways, hope you enjoyed this lesson. By the way, if you want to learn more other League of Legends songs, I've done a lot of those tutorials on my channel. So just search up League of Legends, Amos Doll, and you can find those lessons to learn for yourself. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.